Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ari. I'm a Taurus Sun, Cancer Rising, Aquarius Moon, and a Life Path number seven. If you're not new here, thank you for watching another video of mine and choosing to support me further. It does mean a lot to me. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe before you do leave this video, especially if you're able to relate or connect with this message. So today, everyone, I'm here with a channel messages reading from your person for all of my Scorpios out there. So if you have Scorpio as your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or anywhere in your chart, this message might apply to you. Your person, Scorpio, is whoever is currently on your mind right now. You two may be in separation and communication at a distance from one another. Just whoever in your heart is your person. That's your person, and you'll know. Before I do get into this reading, Scorpio, please keep in mind this is a general reading for all of my Scorpios out there, so it may not resonate or relate to you specifically, and if it doesn't, please don't take it personally. Alright, Scorpio, so let's go ahead and see what messages we have from your person. Cross watchers, you are welcomed as well. All right, so this card came out very easy. We have, I look for you and everything. You are truly beautiful. I know I should be focusing on me, but I want you. I know you're willing to do anything, but that's not good enough. All right, Scorpio. So also please keep in mind if I'm speaking from your person's perspective, that could be how you feel. Roles could be reversed, just however this reading resonates for you. This is also a timeless love reading. So any energy I'm describing throughout it can apply to the past, the present, the future of your connection. And if you're not connected to anyone at this time, this could be someone from your past or someone who's coming towards you. Scorpio, um... I feel like there's some quiet energy um, within this connection. Of course, we'll know more with the cards next to come, but I feel like you and this person might not be as close as you once were. It, I feel like there were some complications in this connection. Maybe just someone wanting to be in this connection. You, Scorpio, obviously you wanted to be in this connection with this person but i feel like your person did as well but there were some things that they couldn't really work around and scorpio you may have known that they may have expressed that to you um or scorpio i feel like with them having some things coming in the middle of this connection they may have made it seem like they were on track with you. They were ready to pursue this with you, but they started to flake out or they just started not to be true to, to their word, true to their word. And Scorpio, I feel like you felt like this was wasting your time and giving you a false impression of what this person's real intentions were. Um, it's like Scorpio, First, we have, I look for you in everything. You are truly beautiful. This is your person's energy to you, Scorpio. I feel like this person obviously recognized the beauty that you have, your energy, and they wanted to be around that, but they it's like they want to pick and choose when they want to connect with you, Scorpio. But I feel like they, they always instilled some benefit of the doubt, like... You're what I want, Scorpio. You're who I want. And in time, things will progress. But I just feel like their, their actions and their efforts weren't cutting it here. I know I should be focusing on me, but I want you. I feel like this could be a mutual energy here, Scorpio. Um, I feel like this is a person that you did want something with. And you, Scorpio, you may have kept trying or like I said, giving this connection the benefit of the doubt for your own self, thinking things will pick up based off of what your person is telling you because it's like they treated you like they wanted to be in a connection with you. Um, but I feel like you, Scorpio, whenever you did have a doubt 
within this connection or from this person, you didn't let that override the feelings that you have for them and you chose to be in this connection still. I feel like this is also your person's energy, recognizing that they do want something with you, Scorpio, but maybe not taking in the reality of their situation. I know you're willing to do anything, but that's not good enough. I feel like this is your energy towards this person, Scorpio, and I'll go ahead and clarify that with um, the remaining cards. Okay, this card came out pretty easily too. We have third party. I've worked hard on us, but I also know my worth. You are my wish fulfillment. Sorry, that's a little bit hard to see. Okay, Scorpio. Um, this I feel like this person did lead you on or you felt like this was going somewhere Scorpio but you you find out that this person's mind is elsewhere and no no matter their actions towards you even the good ones the fact that they were maybe involved with other people or just giving you a false impression even if they were giving you those good actions you weren't accepting that Scorpio because it's like how could you be this way with me but you're still not, it's like this person had a double life in a way. They were in your life, Scorpio, things are going well, but then on the other hand, they have some things that you don't know about. For some of my Scorpios watching, you may have been in a third party situation. This does not have to resonate for you, but I feel like your mind was on this one person, Scorpio, and you thought they were with you, but they they somehow deceived you and you found out about it, Scorpio, or you just trusted your intuition and you knew that something was off here. I feel like this person does try to come back into your life or they do try to reconcile with you, Scorpio, but I feel like it's the same old, same old. Like they're not offering anything new um, because I feel like this person did make it known that they want you Scorpio but right now they can't just handle a full-blown relationship and it's not like you were pressing them on it Scorpio um but you just had a different belief than the reality of things and it's because this person made you not made you but it their actions and their words it it made you feel like you two were on the same page with things. So we have, I know you're willing to do anything that's not good enough. I feel like this is your energy towards your person. I do feel like they try to keep in contact with you. They still want to see you, Scorpio. But you know what this person has to offer you. And this, that's not what you want. I've worked hard on this, but I also know my worth. This is also your energy, Scorpio. I feel like with this person, you may have been getting to know them for a while, still on this casual, in in a casual stage or yeah, just knowing them casually, but also thinking that this might turn into something more when the time is right. But now Scorpio, it's more about, you could have been honest with me, even if you, because I feel like this person led you on to feel like you two were casually getting to know one another one on one. Um, so with you, Scorpio, you, you would have been fine with the truth. That's not hard for you to handle at all. Um, but since this person chose the immature route and played on your emotions, even wasted your time, you, you don't want any of that. You, you're better off without it. So you're choosing to step away from this connection. But this person, Scorpio... You might know more to, well, you will know more, their personality, what they have going on, the truth of the situation. We have your, you are my wish fulfillment. This person, Scorpio, they, they want you. 
And when a person wants someone else, it's not always for the best reasons, the right reasons, but they want to be around your energy and your beauty, Scorpio. I'm not, it's like, you're someone they ideally would want to pursue something with, but I, it's more about are they deserving of that? And I feel like that's, that's what's sticking out to you, Scorpio, um, because I do feel like you're choosing not to really pursue anything more with this person because of the way they deceived you, even in the slightest way. So last two cards, or three cards. I'm sorry, I can't solve your insecurities. Knowing you has changed me for the better. I've got your back. You are good with me. Scorpio, this person... Um, they lost a good lover. That's you, Scorpio. They lost someone that was going to be be by their side. And even while knowing this person, I feel like you were by their side, Scorpio. You were understanding of the emotions that they were dealing with, or at least what they told you. We have, I've got your back. You're, you are good with me. That's your energy, Scorpio. You're a very loyal, loyal sign. And this person did recognize that, but they, some people want, want people, want things, but they're still acting low vibrational. And this is because there's a little bit of greediness coming in because they want what they feel like they can't have. So even when they're deserving or not deserving, even when they, they get what they feel like they can't have, they take a lot sometimes and they they take a lot because of the fear of missing out i'm sorry i can't solve your insecurities i feel like this is your energy scorpio i feel like the truth that you know now it has you kind of putting this person together in your head and realizing that this wasn't the person for you if you do resonate with that i feel like you're piecing together what they really wanted from you, Scorpio. And now looking back at this person or at this situation, this is someone, like, you know your worth. This is someone that had their chance, but that chance is no longer there and you don't want anything to do with them. Knowing you has changed me for the better. I feel like this is a mutual energy here. Um, from your person's energy, Scorpio, knowing you has changed me for the better. They felt secure around you. They felt like they had someone. And also they were taking in some of your energy. Your energy made them feel way better. But this is also your energy, Scorpio, because this whole situation really showed you something. It, I feel like it taught you. First, I feel like it fed into your, your self-worth, like, you valuing yourself and not putting up with anything less than what you you deserve Scorpio but I also feel like this is a person or a connection that you look back on now and you think about maybe how you're you're glad that you weren't in too deep with this person but I will go ahead and leave it at that that's all I do have for my Scorpios today as always I appreciate the love and support please like comment and subscribe and I will talk to you next time bye